The mainstream media suggests that the Australian property market is set to crash by 30%. But here are five reasons why we think the market will not crash. Before I even get into the five reasons, let's also look at some historical data. It's important to note that the Australian property market has never crashed by 30%. In fact, the most that it went down was by 8% over the 2017-2019 period when you had huge FERB restrictions and the Royal Commission putting a massive dampener on the property market. So here are the five reasons why we don't think it's actually going to crash even by more than 10%. One, Aussie households are wealthier than ever. The CBA experts predict that over $250 billion was saved during the COVID pandemic as a result of prolonged lockdowns and a lack of social spending opportunities. Aussies have saved more than ever before. Two, interest rates are still low. Even with the third rate rise, bringing the cash rate to 1.85%, this is still well below the long-term or 30-year average of 3.5%. Experts predict that the cash rate will top out at around 25 to 3 which is around about where it was before the COVID pandemic. And guess what? The media weren't telling you that everybody was in mortgage stress and the market was going to crash then. Three, we have a very strong banking system. The banks have been evaluating you at about 2.5% above the current cash rate all the way up till October last year when they raised that to 3%. This means that the banks are evaluating your ability to service your mortgage at 3% above the current cash rate. This means that if the banks give you a mortgage, they believe that you are able to service this mortgage at even with further rate hikes. Four, our borders are back open. During the COVID pandemic, Australian population growth came almost down to zero as we shut our borders to try and stop the spread of the COVID-19 virus. But as of February 2022, the borders are back open with Domain estimating that population will peak at about 1.5% growth over the 24-25 period. This is about 350,000 new migrants coming into the country who traditionally look to rent in apartments and who are going to need places to stay. This alone should underpin the property market. And finally, our economy is strong. Basically, anybody looking for a job could get one right now with unemployment levels at a 50-year low of 3.5%. Add to this rising wage growth and everything points to our economy being able to get through the current rate hikes and move into a period of stabilization where we believe we should see property prices remain flat for a certain amount of time. A 30% market crash? No way. Do you differ with me? Feel free to comment below and like and share for more tips and videos.